sure like it. Good morning, everybody. So we are back at the Goodwill Bins, and I've been filming a new video for you guys where I have um, four events coming up. I'm doing all the events together in one video to show you guys what profit I make. And so far, the first event went wonderful. Right now, I have no video for you guys planned, so I thought, why not come to the Goodwill Bins and film you guys a video but i wanted to do something different so i thought about it and i think i'm gonna do a video of 24 hours at the google bins and see what we can find here so basically you're wondering how do you do 24 hours at the bins because you cannot stay the night well i want to time up my hours of how much time i'm here and then add it all together to the 24 hours of footage and we'll see what i find in 24 hours at the google outlet so let's get in here and let's find some amazing things for you guys at least let's hope we find some good things um looking kind of empty in here today so let's see what we can get in here I told you guys i have to put elevator music in the background because of this music that's why so loud in here it's insane so I've retold that they restocked this this morning, so I've been digging through all this. I haven't found really anything crazy. I did find this Tweety right here. Um, so since we are late here at the Google Bins, I did have to go through the redig. So I didn't get this on record, but I just found it. So we got the 1996 Warner Brothers Tweety. It says, I may look tweet. And then you flip it on the back. It is pretty worn. Uh, the Looney Tunes tag has been like, let me get over here in the light for you guys. The Looney Tunes tag has been like washed completely off, but we got single stitched, a little rough on the sleeves too. But so it says, I might, I may look tweet. 1996 Warner Bros. Flip it on the back. And then on the back, you got, but I'm spoiled rotten, y'all. Spoiled rotten. Got a little hole right here, but this is a great little piece for the $10 pile. I feel like somebody will definitely wear this. So we got that. And then when you turn around over here, this is the other thing I found off camera. Um, we got the long sleeve wave runner, but um, little early 2000s tag. Um, Pluto catching a frisbee, wave runner, so little Mickey long sleeve shirt, size medium. This one is like a one size fits all, so both of these right here are kind of weird sizes. I don't usually sell medium that well. And then the one size fits all is really boxy, so it's more like a 3XL, but hopefully, oh, I see they are dumping the bin, so hopefully some more good stuff will come out, and this will not be the only thing we leave with today.
recording, but we got this Winston Cup jacket. Like, you just know when you see this, what it is. But it was just hidden in there, in the plastic. Somebody had it at the dry cleaners and then donated, I guess. So far, I've already checked out all my stuff. So, we have a whole trash bag loaded in the car of stuff. I'm super excited to show you guys what I got. You guys saw me find it. But I'm going to show you at the end of the video what we got. On the restock. Hopefully some good stuff. I was going to show you guys the outfit of the day. This outfit is going to look better, but... The black baggy car and the shark AOT. Better in my head, but it's alright, it's alright. It's cool fit, got the shark hat, you know. Dude, these are sick. Wow. They're huge, but we got like the Y2K style. <laughs> Yo, I just found this off camera. We got the Harley Davidson. Oh, I just dropped one. We got the Harley Davidson. Like, it's a big size, 2XL. Y'all tell me why Sneezy was bidding against my grandma at a yard sale. <laughs> I kind of walked up and found. Found. Look at, look at it, look. The freaking iPod? Or what is it? MP3 player? I thought. All right, for all you haters that say that I don't ever pull any vintage, I got the true vintage right here. This thing is stiff as I'll get out. Like, it literally folds together. It's literally paper thin. Got the hunting jacket. This thing's like the texture of a freaking burrito. What's going on guys? We're at the Goodwill outlet and I got my boy Raiden with me. So we're going to be at the Goodwill bins here and then another look. He's literally a superstar. Y'all tell Raiden to make a YouTube channel. Come on now. <laughs> Alright, let's get in here and see what we can find. I saw that bizarre. So beautiful. Uh, and look at Sneezy's shirt. He is getting very Halloween themed in here. It was a graveyard smash. We're waiting for them to uh, dump some stuff right here. Oh, guys, we're at the bins and just wanted to say happy Halloween. Got the candy corn poop for all you crayon eaters. There you go. Um, anyway, just looking around in these bins, trying to see what people might have missed out on and stuff. But, um, did see this, like, doll that was giving me, like, clearly old. I don't know anything about it. Like, I should, it might be a custom, I don't know. Got the doll. I don't know. Let's get over here and see the boys. I just want to say, Goodwill, stop the scary music. Stop it. Oh shoot, I almost dropped the phone. Y'all look what Raiden found. The 1989 Super Mario oh, Brothers truck. Oh my God, that's insane. Insane. Going for it, going for it. Oh. I'm all with the whole team. Nah, nigga, can't that's a call because I'm all in. I was waiting to oh, get it oh, raised in. I'm all That was funny. I was broke. <laughs> now I'm rich. These niggas saw it. See if possibly went. I just want to point out, I got this cutie right here on my bumper. Follow me from. Alright guys, 
here's what we got right here. We got the like small diamond, little flat, needs a little reshaping pro line, logo athletics. Then we got Pee Wee. I don't know who Pee Wee is, but we got two of them. Pee Wee. Like I should know who this is. Oh, I also got this off camera, but we ain't gonna get that, but. Bins. I just found this beautiful hat in the bins. Brand new Pee Wee Herman or whatever hats. They're in like really good condition. No flaws, no yellowing. Yep. So I'm looking at the comps on these and they're going for about $65 to $120 depending on the color and condition. So I'm hoping to get at least $80 bucks a piece for them. So I'm super excited. The hats are doing good today. And let's get back in here. Got this banger right here. Old Nike tag, old little beautiful piece. And then the Patagonia. unorganized my videos are as of right now with the GoPro being dead uh, past three days I've been loading up on stuff and you're gonna see at the end of the video everything that I found so I hope it's good enough for you guys I didn't have the GoPro so I'm filming with my phone walking around finding stuff and luckily nobody's here like literally nobody so we're finding some great stuff I have no competition it's having a good time have y'all ever been to the Goa Bins when nobody's here? Literally nobody. There's like a champion uh, way for us, but sadly somebody cut it. Thanks a lot, girls. Um, and then we got the screen stars. First, I was a good boy. Then I became a nice kid. I was a great guy. Later, I grew up to be a fine man, and now I'm just an old fart. Little single stitch, funny tea. Pretty cool. 
Oh, we're definitely gonna get this one. And you guys, we are out. Two big bags full. Let's get home and show you guys what we got at the Gilroy Outlet. Y'all, there is literally a hurricane coming. All right, so I have an event uh, tomorrow in Wilmington, North Carolina, down by the coast. And as you guys can see, there's literally a hurricane coming. But we're gonna make the best of it. But gotta basically do everything inside. So I want to show you guys, to show you guys what all I got this week on my 24-hour challenge at the Goodwill Bend. So I'm gonna lay it out and show you guys. But um, so first off, I want to explain that. We went to a different Goodwill bins and there was bed bugs inside the bin. So we left. But I did get this piece to be on the safe side so I don't bring any bed bugs home. I took it to the dry cleaners, washed it twice. I did it one side outside and then I flipped it inside out and did it again. Dried it both sides so the heat would kill anything if there was anything on it. But sadly, when I put it in the washing machine the first time it got bleach on it i don't know who put bleach in washing machine and ruined my car heart. i'll take all that lettering out and embroidery so it'd just be a blank one so i gotta go home and do that i don't know who's big on kid is screaming but uh so we are going to be packing up the truck today and then leaving tonight and going down to wilmington north carolina driving in the hurricane hopefully everything goes smooth and well so first off we had the car heart Due to the hurricane, the doors are shaking and then there's a kid next door screaming his lungs out like he has no sense. But I ain't gonna be a Karen. Anyway, I have to um split everything up because it's so much stuff. I literally have like limited space because I have all these racks here. Um and the honestly like from all these events our uh storage unit always gets destroyed because we basically just throw everything in here and leave. Because it's usually beaming hot here so it's literally a mess it's kind of embarrassing but i'm gonna show you guys in sections what we got so i think we actually might have more carhartt pants but we got some carhartt pants got a harley davidson this is pretty cool um the old american eagles outfitter on the old american eagle tag super cool made in usa never seen anything like that so cool got the ed hardy Got the NC State Reverse Weave, Carhartt pants, and then the Carhartt. Honestly, really nothing special about this, but you guys know I'm a big Suns fan. So, future kid, future mini thrift trip in 90s kid. All right, so now that the door has quit rocking again, uh, this is the second round of stuff, and then getting down to the final bags. Uh, got the... This one's probably one of my favorites in this bunch. The Screen Stars, uh, like 80s Mickey and Minnie. And it's got the back on it too, which is pretty cool. Cause she has like a letter for him. They're so in love. Yep, that's pretty cool. And then we got Ollie. Got the, the funny single stitch t-shirts, which are cool. This one is Wrangler. Uh, I haven't even looked this one up yet. Um, but on the Haynes 5050, single stitch, some motorcycle, little racing coat for the ladies, got the hockey jersey, and a little crew neck. This one is on a Russell. That's right here. I'm gonna dump them all out. You guys already saw it. Logo, uh, Logo Athletics, Pro Line. San Francisco 49ers. Little small diamond. Beautiful inside. Super clean. Do y'all hear this dang hurricane? This crap's insane. Just constantly keeps shaking the doors. Got the little Patagonia. Irish soccer. From the old college tag. The old like thick snaps if y'all know what I'm talking about. This is probably one of my favorites. We got the old Nike. Let me get some better lighting for y'all. Y'all deserve the lighting. Uh, we got the Just Do It Barcelona little Nike right there. You flip it on the back. You got the nice little strap back, the little settle 
Nike check. And it's got the nice little white tag right there. We got that. And then we got the two Pee Wee hats. Which I'm probably going to sell on eBay instead of taking them to my event. Got this 98 Dale Earnhardt hat. This, um, kind of brain fart, but the, uh, Boston Indians or whatever. Um, I don't even know what they're called. I'm having a whole brain fart right now. I got the Good Ranch right there. Anyway, guys, I'm hanging up everything from the bag. Laying it all out so you guys can see it and then hanging it up. If you guys want any of this stuff, we have so much stuff, y'all. We got puffers. We got uh all so if you guys come down to wilmington north carolina to our event oh uh, colorful racks are ten dollars each or three for 25 the black racks are nicer things they're 20 bucks a piece or three for 50 and then the um velvet racks right here are 25 and up and that is crew necks right there and then i have the t-shirts over here got um we have jerseys car hearts everything you name it and then we'll have a five dollar pile so we have all these racks um i could bring more racks but i'm not sure how big our space is going to be so as of right now this is what we have to work with i'm going to throw up another one of course i'm going to have four at least and then space them out so i'll do like premium and then outerwear and then twenty dollar and ten dollar so anyway if you guys want any of our stuff we are going to be at wilmington and the date will be right here the location It'll be tomorrow, Sunday. I'm going to try to get this video up tonight for you guys. So you guys have a chance to get down there if you want to. Um, and then we're going to have these. Uh, we're going to have a bunch of $5 hats. I have a whole basket right there. You guys usually see it. Um, I'm keeping it covered as it's a surprise. We'll have sports specialties in there. Um, let's see. I got this hat right here. It's an old 100% uh, wool made in USA right here. Five bucks. It's going to be in the $5 thing. So we'll have a bunch of $5 hats. And we'll have some special price hats, some $5 hats. Um, pants. We have uh, some dead stock orange tab Levi's. They're special price. Jenko, special price. But I do have camo pants down here at the bottom. Camo pants. Carhartt, all 20 bucks a piece. So y'all can load up on your pants. Um, so let's get through this last bag so I can get home and get the video up. I might bring some shoes. I'm not sure really yet what my space is looking like but definitely have so many five dollar hats we have a lot of five dollar pile stuff there's five dollar t-shirts and outerwear like uh sweatshirts and crew necks in the five dollar pile you can't beat that we got twenty dollar car hard pants got a hurricane we got a uh, special price pants i even got a pair of dead stock car hearts right here y'all dead dead stock brown patch car hearts with the tags right there 38 by 32 20 bucks where are you gonna get some dead stock car hearts for 20 bucks at um so yeah we got jerseys too back there at the back more car heart so yeah i hope to see you guys in wilmington north carolina and let's finish the rest of this stuff so i laid out all the pants to show you guys we got jenko's and these orange tag uh dead stock levi's they even have the old sears tag on them they are special price, but all these over here, camo uh, cargo pants, dickies, like faded dickies, and all these Carhartt, 20 bucks a piece. Then over here, we have our specialty price uh, stuff. We got script, just some basic stuff. Um, yeah, all these are like 20 bucks and up. Uh, they're, yeah, $20 and up right here. Colorado Rockies, a little faded, but for 20 bucks, pretty cool. Um, got some NASCAR down there, some old corduroy NASCAR, yeah, there's a few in here that are like 10 bucks too, but all these are going up to Wilmington, North Carolina for this weekend, um, I'll show you guys, here's the nicer ones right here, look how beautiful these are, y'all saw these in our last video, I hope, I think some of the, uh, this one I think is like 10 bucks, so, um, we got some really nice hats going up to Wilmington, and then we're also going to be having an event in Raleigh and Durham coming up, so all these are specialty price, $10 and up. So yeah, got lots of hats for you guys.
Lots of clothes, $5. Yeah, I already explained it all. I don't gotta explain it again. You guys already know where it's at. First trip in 90s. I had to do, I had to pull the door up because it was just rattling too much. But um, some more stuff that'll be at the event. We got these like baggy Y2K, lots of pocket style jeans. Then we got National Geographic 2006, Meet the Beatles. Right there, got some old Mickey Mouse, 90s pieces, 90s Tweety Birds, y'all saw at the beginning of the video, 1996, a little early 2000s Pluto. Alright, update, so we got this nice little beautiful Hanes Heavyweight Single Stitch Neon Fish Shirt. This is brought to you by Raiden, once again, always giving me the blessings. But I just, I really don't got time to oxy all this stuff. I leave in just a couple hours. So that's it, y'all. We got everything hung up, everything priced. Y'all, I'm even the Ed Hardy jeans right here. 20 bucks, women's Ed Hardy jeans. All right, guys, this is the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, like I said, I didn't get a lot of it cleaned. So some of it is going dirty to the event. But as soon as I get home, if I have any of it left, I will definitely clean it for you guys. Um, if you're located, why do these people do this to me? They like have to be, always be loud while I'm filming an outro. Anyway, uh, if you guys want to come shop with us, we have a event in Wilmington, North Carolina this weekend. As well as one next weekend in either Raleigh or Durham. So if you're located in the North Carolina area and you want some stuff for the low... We have things as low as $5 and up. We got hats for $5, t-shirts and crew necks for five bucks. Got some specialty price hats for you guys. Some pretty awesome stuff. I'm always sourcing every day except for today because I have to pack, but I'm fighting this hurricane. So anyway, guys, if you're new to the channel, like the video, subscribe, and we'll see you guys next video.